Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you all are fine. I always pray that you live long and always be happy in your life. I try my best to provide you the latest and authentic information about the Iraqi currency. So be connected with me and my YouTube channel. Before start the video I have a request to you all watch this video till end. Please like, share and subscribe my channel. Let's start. Iraq's financial landscape is making headlines, and today we're diving into some significant numbers recently revealed by the Iraqi Ministry of Finance. Over the first five months of 2024, Iraq's financial revenues have surpassed a staggering 54 trillion dinars, which is about $41.3 billion. Yes, you heard that right, $41.3 billion in just five months. This impressive figure showcases the robust performance of Iraq's economy, particularly its oil sector, which continues to be the backbone of the nation's revenue stream. Breaking down the numbers, the data from the Ministry of Finance for the months of January, February, March, April and May of this year show that oil exports remain Iraq's primary source of income, accounting for an overwhelming 89% of the total revenue. This means that the lion's share of the 54 trillion dinars came from oil, underscoring just how pivotal this resource is for Iraq's general budget. Despite global shifts towards renewable energy and a diversified economy, Iraq still heavily relies on its oil exports. The stability and growth of this sector are crucial not just for the government's budget, but also for the country's overall economic health and development. But it's not just about oil. The data also highlight non-oil revenues, which amounted to 6.78 trillion dinars, roughly $5.2 billion. While this is a much smaller portion compared to oil, it's still a substantial amount and shows there is some diversification in Iraq's revenue streams. Non-oil sectors include things like taxes, customs and other fees, which although they represent a smaller slice of the pie, are vital for building a more resilient economy. These revenues can help Iraq reduce its dependency on oil over time, particularly in an era where global oil prices can be volatile and unpredictable. So what do these numbers mean for Iraq's future? First, it shows that Iraq continues to benefit greatly from its oil wealth, but it also highlights the need for economic diversification. Relying on oil for 89% of the national budget is risky, especially with the global economy's increasing focus on sustainable and renewable energy sources. The good news is that there's already a noticeable amount of revenue coming from non-oil sources. This suggests that with the right policies and investments, Iraq has the potential to expand these sectors further. In conclusion, Iraq's financial performance in the first five months of 2024 paints a picture of a country with significant oil wealth, but also one that must think strategically about its economic future. The $41.3 billion in revenues, largely driven by oil, underscores both a strength and a challenge. On one hand, the oil sector provides substantial income and opportunities for growth. On the other hand, it highlights the vulnerability associated with over-reliance on a single resource. Moving forward, it will be crucial for Iraq to continue to explore ways to diversify its economy, tapping into its non-oil sectors to create a more balanced and sustainable financial future. Thank you for tuning in and make sure to stay with us for more updates on Iraq's economic journey.